Hey guys, it's Brooke here, and today's video is going to be an explaining what happened to my wrist, if you guys didn't know. Yeah, I broke my wrist, and I just wanted to explain it more in depth, because I did kind of explain it in my vlogmas videos, but not a lot of people watch those, and I'm sure people are wondering, Brooke, what exactly happened to your wrist? Um, so I'm just going to make an explaining video here. Also, I'm so sorry, this is horrible quality, I already know that, um... It's because I'm at my aunt's house, plus, so the lamp is right there, and it's not very good, like, lighting for YouTube. Like, I mean, it's a lamp, like, it's good for, like, your room, just not for YouTube. And I'm also filming on my phone. So, yeah, but I am gonna edit this on my MacBook, because I brought my MacBook, and it's me. But, yeah, um, let's just get into this video. Okay, guys, so, this is gonna be, like, a story time video, so, um... Um, like a week ago or something no more than that it was like in the be early December I don't remember what day you could go back to my vlogmas videos and you could figure that out um, but I don't know exactly what day it was um, I was going to a basketball game if you guys didn't know I played travel basketball um, I'm pretty good if I do say so myself um, but, like, I mean, I'm not the best, obviously, but, like, otherwise I'd play AAU, but I'm not that good. Um, so, I wouldn't be playing basketball. Here's a little um, background. So, I've played basketball since I was in, like, third, third grade, fourth grade, something like that. I've been playing for a very long time. I mean, not that long, but, like, four years now. That, that was not four. Four years now. Um... So, and I really enjoy basketball. Um, so, a year ago, I believe, um, in the summer of sixth grade, I'm in eighth grade now, um, two years ago, um, in the summer of sixth grade, it was like the day before we got out for school um, in the summer, um, and I fractured my wrist. Um, I was going up to go, like, I was running back. Um, when someone was dribbling down the court, someone on the other team was dribbling down the court, and I was running back to block them. So I put my right hand up, and I come down on my wrist, like, really bad, and I fractured it. But I kept playing the whole game because I was like, my team sucks, and I'm the best player, which I was at that time. And I'm not being like, oh my god, I'm the best player. No, like, I was honestly the best player. Like, everyone else had come from house, and I'd been playing select for a couple years. And I didn't want to go out, so I played through it. And then at the end of that, um, I told my mom, I started crying. I walked out and my mom came running and she was like, oh my God, Brooke, what happened? One of my friends walked and she was like, oh my gosh, are you okay? And I was just bawling because it hurt so bad. And it ended up being a fracture right here. And that was the first time I hurt my wrist. And this one's not in the same place. But yeah, now fast forward to a couple weeks ago, I was asked to play um so basketball again I wasn't going to because I was like I just I, I got injured I don't really enjoy this sport too much anymore because I mean like I'm always the best player on my team and it sucks and we always lose and like it just I just don't like being the best player to be honest on the team because if you're the best player on the team you literally have to carry your team on your shoulders at least most of the time and I do not like that pressure because I don't think anyone likes that pressure um, but yeah, so, um, they asked me to come play, and I did, and, because my friend kind of asked me to play, it's not her fault, by the way, if you're watching this, it's not your fault, um, I actually, I was like, okay, let's give it another try, let's do this, so, we kind of didn't have enough players, we only have, like, eight players on the team, and if you guys didn't know, it's, like, ten supposed to be, but, yeah, and plus now I'm out, but, yeah, um, so, um, fast forward to that game, so I was playing in this game, these girls were, like, a foot taller than me, probably 100 pounds bigger than I am, I am small, I'm not that big for a basketball player, also, don't have that many, like, that much muscle, um, <laughs> let's be real, I have more muscle in my legs, because I'm a more soccer player, I've been playing since I was five, but, whatever, um, but yeah, these girls were huge, like, trust me, ask any other girl on our team, these girls were, like, giant, 
Um, also, they were pushing us around all game. A girl on my team already got elbowed in the eye. And fast forward to the play where I broke my wrist. So, um, my friend, Katie, she was dribbling down the court. And because she's a point guard, um, I'm just a guard. Well, I can be a point guard, but, like, I don't know. But never mind that. But, um... Katie was dribbling down the court. She passed it to me. This girl, I did not see her. I was going for a three because, I don't know, I wanted to make a three. And I had already, like, okay, yeah. I just wanted to make a three. And I went up to go shoot my wrist, like, everything. I was ready to shoot. Then this girl ran, probably 100 pounds bigger than I am, ran in and stuffed me, but not, like, a normal stuff like she could have easily got the ball for me like let's be real but she stuffed me so hard she literally broke my wrist um her hand never hit my wrist it was all the ball she stuffed or like she like smacked the ball into my wrist and if you're strong enough to do that like you could have gotten the ball any other way but like and I went down on the ground crying I was bawling I was screaming ask anyone else there I would probably traumatize everyone because I was screaming my head off because I was so yeah it was just not a fun experience so I went down I went like this I was holding my arm because I was so scared I was on the ground like laying back um on the ground of the court everyone all the coaches got all their players to the sides um I don't remember what league it was but, yeah, um, besides the point, we were losing, not by that much, though. We were losing by about, like, 10 points. We were coming back in the game, and so, yeah, and so my mom is screaming at the ref. She's like, um, sorry, mom, but I'm gonna give you up here, but my mom screams at the ref. She's like, um, what does she say? She said, um, that girl should be ejected. She was just screaming. She was, you know, having a mom panic attack because her girl was on the ground screaming and crying with her arm like this. And she knew, already knew that it was broken because, I mean, that impact was so hard. I didn't fall on my wrist or anything. Like, I went down like this. Um, then my mom called, she, like, yells out to the stand. She's like, someone called 911. So my mom's friend, or my friend's mom called, um, she called the um 911 they said do not move her do not move her because I could injure something even more so <laughs> a stretcher came and I went out on a stretcher which was so scary to me I was like am I gonna die all these horrible thoughts were going through my mind it was probably like the worst day of my life like I was oh that was bad um also, I was thinking about Vlogmas. I was like, Vlogmas is over. <laughs> I mean, that's the worst thing to think about. But, like, I mean, like, I shouldn't have been thinking about that. But whatever. Um, So I got on the stretcher. All the girls are like, oh, my God, feel better. I hope it's okay. All of my teammates, like, come while they're pushing me out. And everyone claps. And I'm just, like, crying. Like, them clapping made it worse for me. I don't know why, but it did. And it was kind of weird. I don't know. It just made me cry more. Um, so then I get in, like, the ambulance, and it's very bumpy, very bumpy, might I say. Like, the roads were not very good where we were. Um, and, um, actually, I can cross off being in an ambulance off my wish list, which probably, I mean, my wish list, my, um, bucket list, because, uh, that was on my bucket list for some reason. I didn't want to be injured, I just, it was just on my bucket list, so yeah. Um. And so we went to the hospital. They were like, um, I don't know if it's broken or not. Um, so they did some x-rays there. Um, and they came back and they said, yes, um, her wrist is broken. Good thing they did that quickly, though, because otherwise they would have had to IV'd me. If you guys know what that is, they, like, put a needle in you and they, like, are, like, putting liquids into you if that makes sense um so yeah and they also um to put me in the x-ray room they put fentanyl if you guys know what that is it's like a really controversial drug like medicine so they put 
fentanyl up my nose. Kind of scary because it's been all over the news and stuff. And so, yeah, but fast forward. The next day I woke up, we went to the, what are they called? Uh, uh, what are they called? Orthopedics. I think that's what it's called. And they got this cast on me. This is my, my cast. Um, I picked this pattern because I wanted to be a hippie. I don't know. Um, I just picked this pattern because I was like, you know what? If I broke my wrist, let's just have some fun with it. I don't really know. I just wanted to be positive because it hurt so bad. And sleeping at night was horrible. I had sausage fingers. It was bad. Um, but yeah, and then I got sick. Um, the fentanyl, I believe I had a bad reaction to the fentanyl because our family has not had good reactions to medicines, like very strong medicines. So I got sick. I threw up a couple times. So I got three weeks of break. Everyone else got two, um, but I got three weeks because I was sick. Um, if you guys are wondering why I was out of school for a whole week before break, um, that's why. Um, yeah, so that's the story of me breaking my wrist. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I mean, it's fun to do story times. It just kind of sucks because that hurt a lot and not a good experience for me and again sorry for the horrible quality like i know this is a step down from all of my videos so if this is your first video seeing me go check out my other videos especially go check out my what i got for christmas i will put it up there in the eye go watch that because it's a lot better quality and so much more fun and uplifting than this video was so yeah if, and if you guys want me to do some more story times i will um yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, and comment down below. And I hope by the time that this goes up, maybe we're even closer to a thousand subscribers. Guys, you are literally insane. I like we grew like three hundred subscribe. No, not three hundred. We grew like two hundred subscribers in like I don't know, like a week. I don't know. It was insane, and I love all of you guys. So yeah, <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.